Greetings, ghouls. Here's a little video to help me cope with my post-Halloween depression. Here I am getting ready to go out on Halloween. It was the second year in a row that I've been a vampire on Halloween. Last year I was Harmony from Buffy, but I had the idea for this crazy glam hammer horror style 1960s does 1890s style vampire. I had to do it. Obviously, I don't have the setup to be a beauty blogger, so sorry for the shoddy craftsmanship here. But I really enjoyed making these videos the past couple months. I feel like we can keep the spirit of Halloween alive all year long here. I started this channel for two reasons. One, I love telling stories, and I have so many that I want to share. And I can't keep holding all my friends and loved ones hostage with tales of historical hauntings and unsolved murders. And two, it's a little bit of instant gratification for me, as my other creative outlet is writing, and while my book moves slowly through the ancient and slogging machine that is traditional publishing, I feel very restless and impatient, so making videos gives me something that I can control and put out at my own pace. There's the finished look that I put together. And here I am pouring myself a drink because for the first time in recorded history I was ready before Michael. Here's some of my cute Halloween tchotchkes that I have set up. My tablecloth that I wish that I could keep up all year long. Let me talk about my costume. I was inspired by Hammer's Brides of Dracula in particular, but also Vampire Lovers and all those great gothic romance covers where a lady is running away from a foreboding estate in her negligee. Anyway, I do wish that I'd gotten more footage while I was out in Salem, but I was too busy dodging crowds and enjoying time with friends, so take a moment, just enjoy the vibes, and I hope you stick around with me here and I hope that we can keep the spooky season love flowing all year long. 